Okay, we're back playing Hollow Knight, everyone. As you can see, I moved benches. Uh, the reason I did that is because, hey, listen, I'll come out and admit I looked up where we need to go. Specifically, I mean, I looked up where this fucking shade gate or whatever it's called is in this area. Because I was getting pretty annoyed uh, that I just, just couldn't get to it. And I was like... Almost a hundred percent sure that there is one here and It turns out there is almost It turns out I was mistaken in the elevation Because this is where we need to go I think hold on is this it? I think it's one level below... No, 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 this is the one. I think this is the one. Yeah. If this is not the one, well, you are then never gonna see this. It's gonna stay my little secret, you know. And my shame that I still couldn't get this. Right, even after looking it up in a walkthrough. But I think we got it. Yep. See, this is the weird thing that I remember this area, like it was green and shit. And I was like, yeah, yeah, that must have been the uh, green path area. But no, it just looks like it. This is it. I'm really hoping that this is going to be like something something major this is just okay kind of a pointless shortcut maybe who knows all right we're back in action man let's get to it queen's gardens a uh, completely new area and i immediately got hit by an enemy it's a fucking porcupine queen's gardens Sounds like an end game area to me. Okay, we don't have the map, obviously. I mean, here's the thing. Obviously, this is an end game area because you need end game abilities to get here. Oh, hello. Tiny warrior. Deadly bunch there that roost within these glades. Okay. Good for us then, I guess. Maybe not. This is gonna be hella... Oh, okay. Wonderful. It's gonna be hella enemies in this area. Uh, yeah, Queen's Gardens. It looks very similar to Green, green Path. Oh, shit. Okay, that's how it works. Reminds me of that. You guys remember Resistance Fall of Man? That was a crazy ass game. That game had la I thought that was a hot <laughs> I thought that was a hot spring. Alright then. That was not a suicide attempt. Okay, never mind. <laughs> uh yeah, you guys remember Resistance Fall of Man? Like that game had one of those like like the aliens had a grenade that like exploded in spikes. And it was super broken. I got killed by it many a times. Man, that was a weird game. Resistance. It's like... It was good. I remember that game being good, but... I don't know, man. I wonder why I would think if I went back to it. The second one was okay. The third one, if I remember, was pretty trash. And there was also one on... Okay. There was also one on PSP. Or was it the Vita? I don't know. I did definitely was not the Vita. I can't believe I actually own a Vita. I feel like... I feel like nobody does. I feel like I'm the only person that's ever bought a Vita. It's kind of a shame because... And, you know, obviously... Oh, I'm gonna hate this area. Obviously, I'm not the only one that is 
pointed this out. It's kind of a shame that Sony completely screwed up the PlayStation Vita in terms of like handling the console because it is a pretty good console. I mean, I actually like the Vita quite a lot. I mean, it has like good... It was like a solid piece of tech. I liked the dual analog sticks. It felt stable. Oh shit, is this a mandatory? It is. Okay. I'm getting vibes of... The cliff area. Oh, did you see that save? Listen, I'm not gonna lie, that was a pretty good save. Okay, we have Cornifer. Just which way? Okay, up here. So yeah, you know, I enjoyed the Vita, it's just... It's kind of just sitting there in my basement. I should bring it up, honestly. Or it gets like damaged or some something. I like it too much to let it ruin. Apparently it's a good console for emulations. What? Damn, why is he not here? That's disappointing. At least we have a bench. Okay then, this is gonna suck. I hate when I have to go through an area Wait, but that means you meant to come here earlier then. Are you meant to kill these things? Did, did, did that even give anything? It must have given something. Whatever. I think I know where we need to go. Pretty sure. Well, yeah, man, I think definitely, like, the Vita was, like, the last big kind of Sony screw-up that I can remember. Because, you know, Sony has, the, has its... interesting moments, you know. I'm not gonna, you know, sit here and say that the... Fuck! The PS3 was like... the most well-handled console in the world. Are you kidding? This is such a... Okay. Dick move game. Dick move. Oh. Don't worry. We got this. I'll put one of these enemies here too. Please tell me that actually did something. It unlocked this door. Okay, that was not... I was just about to comment that... That has to be optional. Usually in this game, the really difficult platforming sections are always just like... Leading to some optional treasure. That wasn't the case there. Okay, I'm gonna have to... I'm gonna have to kill every enemy that comes my way because... Boy, ain't doing too hot. Ain't doing? Ain't doing too hot on HP. Oh, come on. This game, man. <laughs> this... It knows how to fuck with me. Yeah. I'm gonna hate this, aren't I? I'm gonna die. I was gonna put them... I knew it. See, I was wondering, I was just about to say that this room is kind of weird in its layout. Okay, I have one HP. 
Hollow Knight, no death run. Oh, it's weird because you gotta like... Kind of stop your momentum. With the wings, but it's not easy to do. Okay. We probably got this. Listen, I'm a platform. Yes, I do. We got this. Okay, so we're 80 away from the next upgrade. Which I'm guessing is good. How am I down to 1 HP again? Oh, fuck. I cannot believe I die. <laughs> That's the enemy I die to. Alright then. Alright then, fine. Let's do this again. Don't have to collect all this bullshit again, at least. That really, going through that spiky area, like, really drained the main vein, you know. And those mantis enemies, too. Alright then. Cool, cool, cool. Nice. Crisis averted. More like disaster averted. We can focus on you. God, this is an annoying enemy in this in this like context, you know. Cause man are they accurate as shit. Yeah. I don't like. I don't like. Oh, fuck. There we go. This better lead to a stack station. Because... Okay, I didn't miss anything. Cool. Yeah, this better. Alright, I'm guessing we're going this way. Man, not having a map is like bothering me. So you should just constantly looking at it. Oh shit. What is that? Luckily, money wise, it's just a bench, isn't it? This is a cool kind of like little. Oh shit. <laughs> Did I just... Okay. Well, I just d destroyed that. My bad if that was, like, anything significant. Can you, like... Fuck off? Okay. They're not gonna, are they? So let's see what's up here. This is an... Yeah, I like this area. I'm gonna... Come on and say it. This is a boss fight. Shit. No, it's not. It is. It's kind of... I just walked into him. Okay, it's not a boss fight. Are these porcupine motherfuckers. Man, this game's combat has gotten, like, way more interesting with all these abilities. Because, you know, initially, it was very, very simple, you know, just dodge. At first, we didn't even have the dodge. It was just jump and jump and slash, you know. But I like how they... have Ramped up the again, very Metroid like shit. All 
I'm I was just about to say I'm about to die. That was a little bit longer than I thought it would be. Well, we can try again. So again, that's like a very Metroid-ish approach of ramping up the complexity. I like it, you know. Okay, let's keep ourselves... Topped off. Jumped into it like an idiot. Shit. Oh. Okay, this is a massacre. This is a... Oh, I swear it. Okay, I'm gonna have to like heal. Yes. Oh, shit. This is gonna be difficult to salvage. Apparently, I've forgotten how to play this game in the span of this area or getting back to this area. Because I'm getting hit by shit I wasn't getting hit by, that's for sure. No! I accidentally shot a spell. Damn! That was really bad. That was awful. I played like an asshole there. Speaking of ramping up the complexity, which is strange because, again, I will say that this game is lightweight compared to many Souls games. It has its moments with difficulty, but overall, like, again, this is... This is some lightweight shit. You know, which is not... God damn it. I've, I haven't gotten hit by this enemy once. And now I'm, like, getting slaughtered. I swear, okay. What the hell did I even get hit by? Yeah, I have, I've, oh, that's what I was. This is really bad. There's still so much left to go. Maybe. Just being aggressive. I'm disappointed. Like, this shit shouldn't be... This... You know, you know those things? You know, I've said this before. I think specifically about this game. Fuck it, let's see what's down here. Uh, specifically about this game too, I think, where it feels like it shouldn't be difficult, but it's still difficult, you know, I feel like that, and this fool keeps, yeah, I kind of had a feeling, I'm going back, I'm not going down without a fight, I'll tell you that much. If I ever do replay this game, I've seen, I've looked at some of the looked up some of the combos you can get for like 
the charms and shit. I really want to try like a magic build. Apparently it's possible. Where you like focus a lot more on... There's like spells which... Not spells, I mean charms. That specifically focus on you being able to have stronger spells. That's kind of... It's kind of my jam, you know. OP magic builds. I fuck with that. Okay, it's difficult to... Dodge through these enemies. Fucking fast, too. Okay. Take a chance to heal. It's an easy wave, you know. Okay, kill him. Shit. Hope this is the last phase. Please be the last phase. Thank you. It is. Why was that so difficult? Like, see, now when I did it, I was like, man, that's not... Wasn't even that bad. Hey, whatever. I'm an expert at this game, so... Don't even worry about it. Of course, they would put platforming sections after that. Geo kind of don't really need it at this point. That well might actually be receiving its share, you know, because again, I do have a lot of Geo that I have no clue what to do with. There's also that other charm dealer. Oh, and you know what? It's just a thing that, like, it's kind of annoying not having, like, warp abilities. You know, this is... We were discussing this on the Saturday Sekiro stream that... Okay, we're gonna not go there yet. That it's kind of... You get used to the constant warping, you know, in these types of games. I know where this is. This is right at the start. Yes, it is. Okay. Okay, so they did a Dark Souls, you know. Where you go a long way and you end up... Probably this is gonna lead to some boss or something. Yeah, this feels... Oh, they give you this charge shit. This is definitely... Feeling... If this is the entrance to a boss fight, then they are being dicks. <sighs> I saved myself there. That map thing is bothering me so much. Oh, hello. I don't know, man. I don't know. This feels like... I don't know. That's all I can say. Because a lot of this feels like I shouldn't be here just yet. It's not like going off of just pure instinct. That this is gonna, you know what? Pretty much went about as awfully as it could have. What I was saying or trying to say is that 
I like fully going off of instinct here and just let's get somewhere. You know. I kinda had a feeling. I mean broken glass, obviously. Oh, it leads to green path again. Oh, and this is this. Nice. Naisu, naisu, naisu. And it gives you this tree. What are the chances of me dying here? Um, I don't know. Probably that shit is going to cover this entire area. I'm scared of it. But then again... Oh wait, this destroys enemies. I, yeah, I didn't even need to. Didn't even need to waste a spell. You use this ability. It's not gonna work. Yeah, I couldn't cancel in time. This is for sure optional. Come on. I fuck with it though. Oh, okay, that's gonna be it. <sighs> you know what? I'm not, not risking it. There's gotta be a bench here somewhere. Actually, wasn't there a bench right at the start, maybe? I don't know. I'm like extremely low on HP. And I've lost track of... Man, I just want a stack station. Oh, we're gonna have to go... Back through here. Oh, oh no. <sighs> this is a long way back, isn't it? Shit. And I'm 27 minutes in. I'm gonna have to do like an episodic cock block. Because I'm not gonna be able to finish on anything significant here. Speaking of cock blocks, you know. Oh yeah, don't even, don't even try that shit on me. There was another, like, main path here. But I, like, push it out of going... Wait, that's not here. Is it above? I think so. Shit. Wait, there was something weird about this. Oh, it's a, it's a door. Probably a shortcut. But see, there's a... Isn't that the stack station sign? I think it is. Shit, there's something here. Oh, please be a stack station. Fuck. This leads to a... Fucking stack station. I'm gonna lose my mind. Here sleeps the traitor's child. That's good to know. Huh. Seriously? I'm not gonna be able to get back, am I? There we go. That was sound like shitty. I, I I'm not I'm not stoned. The stack station sign definitely did show up. Maybe it's this way.
the new enemy. I'm how how am I down to one HP? Okay, I wasn't exactly like high on HP before, but still. This fool is like impossible to hit. Come on, just give me something game. Just give me something. What the hell? There's so many like interesting backgrounds and shit in this game. Yeah, I'm not about to. I am not about to get killed here. Come on. <sighs> they all respawn. I think they all respawned. Hmm, 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 hmm. Is it down here? No, where it, where the hell? I'm dead. I just lost all my geo. That's really annoying. I have no idea where the stack station is. The sign is there, but I don't know. Whatever. I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here. We'll figure out where to go in the next episode. We'll stay on this bench for now and cry about all the geo we lost. Thanks for watching, boys. Yeah. Damn. That was bad. Kind of pissed about that. Peace out.